welcome to another video of uh, of a mud. Um, it has been a very long time since I did a video of about a month of my weight loss journey because um, I haven't really been taking care of myself. Um, I just want to be honest. I haven't really been taking care of myself um, for the past um, few weeks. Um, it has just been very hectic, and I've gained weight. I've gained weight and this is really really this is really really embarrassing this is really really sad because um i feel like i've just let go of myself and um, the clothes that used to fit last year when i was like very very um focused in my weight loss journey they are no longer fitting so this is a sign and i went on a scale i went on a scale and my weight is just so high my weight is very very high so the other days, um, that's why I haven't really just been been recording videos because I felt like I have nothing to share with you um, when it comes to my weight loss journey. So that's why I haven't really been recording any videos um, to update you guys about my weight loss journey, um, especially um, keto or OMAD. But you know the thing that I'm proud of when it comes to my weight loss journey is that I never give up and I always try my best to be very very transparent when it comes to this weight loss journey because it's really not easy. It's really not easy and I always fall back but I always you know pick myself up and say you know what I'm gonna try again. I'm gonna try this thing again. Yeah, so I was looking at this other video, my old video, where I was like just really studying on mud. I would, I could see that you know what, that time I really lost a lot of weight, but now I've gained some weight again. And yeah, I just, I just blame it on myself because this, um, this past few weeks I've just been eating. I've just been an emotional eat. I've just been eating because I'm bored. I've just been eating because you know what, I see somebody else eating. So that has just been my problem. I've been eating like, you know, I've been having like breakfast, I would have like, uh, then I have lunch, then I have snack, then I have, like I've just been having a lot of meals and in big portions, so that is just the reason why that has contributed to me gaining a bit of weight. Um, yeah guys, so I think this video is just all over the place, but um, it's okay because this is just, um, um, on my weekly routine um, before I even forget I just want to go on a scale um, so that I can show you um, like my current weight right now like when I say I've gained weight this is just what I mean okay so I'm just gonna take the scale and just you know um, show you so this is my scale it's even dusty because I don't remember the last time I weighed myself but because I want to restart everything so I am just gonna show you okay <laughs> let's see you see guys do you see God um yeah so as you can see I've gained so much weight from uh, 70 because the last time when I was like very consistent with my um, with my Omad keto routine um, that was last year and I was 72 71 kg by the time and now look here I am 84 kg I'm 84 kg and this is a call to do something this is really a call to do something so um, like I've said um, it has just been hectic I haven't uh, been consistent you know like uh, like working nine to five guys you'll know how difficult it is when you just get at home you are so tired um you don't even want to do anything so that has just been my problem um just this year um it has just been my problem like when i just arrive at home i'm so tired i have no time even just to do the videos you know it's just it's just so difficult the only time i can be able to like you know really shoot the videos and the only time i can really be consistent with my exercises with eating well um normally i do better on weekends but sometimes though weekends i cheat a lot but i'm just gonna try my best um to do well i'm just gonna really really try my best that's just what i want to do 
So I also believe that when it comes to weight loss, I think you should also take care of your body. You should also like, you know, take care of your skin. Um, if you're also trying to lose weight, you should also help your body, like especially your skin. So um, in terms of like taking some supplements. So I just um, received a delivery of the supplements that I just want to try out. Um, but before I show you the supplements, I want to show you like the problem of my skin so i'm just gonna try and zoom in so that i can show you what i'm talking about just have a look so like i was saying guys um <clears throat> when you also do your weight loss journey you should also take your supplements so that it can really help your body um so that you can get that glow so um i just received the delivery um i ordered this um this calista product um how do i even hold the camera so that i can show you too? let me put the camera so um i just ordered this um this calista products um they are two this one is for pigmentation um this one is for just to clear because i have a problem with heat rush so i saw good reviews with this um uh, with this product i saw very good reviews on facebook then i was like you know what i'm just gonna include this in my weight loss journey um yeah so that is just it um yeah so i'm just gonna be using this product um together um i'll take it as supplements this product they're gonna be like supplements for my body um because i want to have that beautiful skin because normally i just i'm always putting on makeup i just want to be able to go out without putting on makeup without worrying about um the dark spots that i have in my face because i have dark spots in my face i feel like um the camera settings are not right because they're not really showing it's just so light at the back it's just so light it's just so white at the back yeah yeah i think that is just um the problem that I suffer from so I just really want to get rid of that I just want to fix my skin I want to fix my weight and I also have the supplements that I take I take uh, magnesium I also take my biotin so that uh, my hair can grow and yeah so that is just what I will be using um, during this um, this week I mean like not this week one during this whole process of uh, of OMAD so I just want to be serious I want to be serious oh god please help me <laughs> because yeah it's just so difficult so I will see um, with the products um, I'll give you a full review after a month or so of using this um, this supplement this Calista supplement um, if they are just really gonna work out for me or not and yeah so that is just it um, that is just it guys so i'm just gonna go on and just show you what i am just gonna prepare so make sure you stay tuned to this video the thing is my skin is really not that bad it's not that bad um somebody would say i ah, know but your skin is fine but i really have this dark spots guys dark spots and i'm always not comfortable going out without putting any foundation because these dark spots are really really annoying I have this you see the pigmentation i really don't like it so that is why i've just decided to include the supplements in my weight loss journey just to see how it is when you take care of your body you're gonna see good results so it's not only about eating right all the time you also have to like help your body by also taking some some supplements which we really need in our body so it should be like the whole full package it should not just be about eating right exercising drinking water you also need some supplements you know you really need some supplements <laughs> yeah so that is it guys that is it that is it For today's lunch i am just gonna be having chicken livers with mashed potatoes i don't know maybe a bit of some 
um, pan roasted uh, veggies I don't know I'll see I um, mean yeah, so my liver like the liver only has 165 calories and mashed potatoes just a cup like this like this it's only 88 calories so it's not that bad for just um, for just some um, on my lunch so it is still very good normally i've realized something with me like when i have potatoes i don't really get really bloated a lot i feel like the caps in the potatoes for me they are fine because i know normally when i eat something that like has a lot of caps the following day i'll be so bloated i'll be all puffed up but when i eat potatoes i'm just just normally fine so yeah it's just okay same as sweet potatoes i have sweet potatoes here um but that one i just love them when i just roast them in my air fryer so let me prepare today's lunch which day is it i think it's day three today So lately I have just decided to use um, non lactose milk because it really helps me um, when I use like the normal one I really get bloated a lot I really get bloated a lot I um, mean yeah, so I've just decided to like use um, non lactose milk let um, me see this one here because I love to have my oats um, I mix it with uh, with water and milk and I really love to have my coffee um, with milk also so the other one was just making me so bloated so bloated so um ever since i've started to use this one um even if i have my coffee um the following day i don't get bloated and i just i just really love it it quite it is quite pricey but but it's worth it it's worth it if you really want to lose um some weight so i am just going to be making um rice um with veggies and meat here i've already marinated it because i feel so lazy so i'm just gonna put it in the air fryer you know air fryer is a lifesaver so i've already marinated it it i just used any spices that i could just find paprika and what else i don't know i forgot the other one <laughs> but anyway i'm just gonna put it in the air fryer then i am ready to go One of the bad habits that I really need to stop is whereby I always buy fruits. Then I'm saying I'm gonna eat, I have some fruits, I'm gonna snack with fruits. Then I don't really have my fruits, and they just end up being rotten in the house because it looks like I'm the only one who eats fruits here. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This is such a big, big waste, you know. I always just buy all these fruits, you know. Look at the apples, they were very, very fresh when I bought them, but. Okay, this is the lime. I'm still using it, but they are they are all rotten. They are no longer fresh and this is such a big waste. 